let us accept the invitation of our Lord today to hate the comfort situation of this world from our life and to love what is godly. Therefore, we are the servants of God even in our eternal heaven. Dear friends in Christ's love, today I would like to reflect with you the Gospel of St. John chapter 12 verses 24 to 26. This passage focuses on the worthy and true servant of the Lord. Jesus says today in today's Gospel that whoever serves him, serves him where he is. In other words, Whoever is the servant of the Lord will attain the kingdom of God. And today Jesus says, Whoever loves his life in this world will not be worthy to go to kingdom of heaven. But whoever hates his life in this world will attain the kingdom of heaven. Which means we have to be in relation with God even when we live in this world. Today the church celebrates the feast of St. Lawrence, deacon, the martyr. St. Lawrence, when he was asked by the church to bring the wealth of the church, he brought the poor people to the church and said, the poor people are the wealth of the church. St. Lawrence's life and mission were dedicated to the poor people of the world and he worked for them and he was one among them. Dear friends, let us examine our, our life today. Do we really appreciate our life in this world because we are related with God? Or do we love our life in this world and hate what is godly? Let us also follow the example of St. Lawrence to heed and accept the poor among us and they are the wealth of the church and wealth of God. What is our attitude towards the poor? And if we are servant of the poor, God says he will be the servant wherever God is. In other words, the wealth of God, that is the poor people, they are the people whom we have to do our service. Let us accept the invitation of our Lord today to hate the comfort situation of this world from our life and to love what is godly. Therefore, we are the servants of God even in our eternal heaven. May Jesus, our Redeemer, redeem us from all inclinations of this world. Amen.